Aloha. Welcome. This is our Tuesday night hula. We're so happy to have you. My name is Kumu Kanoi, and this is our halal slash our home. We're coming to you live from Nu'uanu Valley right here on the island of Oahu in Hawaii. And it's a beautiful, it's turning out to be a beautiful evening. I don't know if you saw that view, but it was actually pouring um, like one minute ago, but they must have known that you're coming because the sun is out getting ready to set here in a, um, about an hour or so. Um, and we're here for hula. So we're so glad that you're with us. We have been celebrating the music of Brada Is all month long. We have finished Wind Beneath, Wind Beneath My Wings. And today we're starting a brand new song or a section of a medley actually we'll be starting white sandy beach of hawaii so i'm excited to begin with you and i think it's time Aloha and welcome back. So many of you joining us from around the world. So I wanted to take a moment to say a hi to a few of you. Send our aloha around the world. So I see Ivy. Aloha from Korea. I also see, um, I'm going to have to work on reading my names in Korean. I'm so sorry. Um, Ivy, maybe you can help me. <laughs> Patricia is joining us from Massachusetts. Drew from Haleiwa originally, but now in Belmont, North Carolina. Barbara, I'm glad you like my dress. It's another rental from Mu'umu'u Mamas. Check them out next time you're on Oahu. Wendy joining us from St. Louis Heights. I'm glad you like my display. I don't know. I was feeling kind of like a Japanese tutu vibe. And so I went with these spikes in my hair. I don't know why, but anyways. <laughs> Linda from Pennsylvania, Cyan Aloha in Aiea. Oh, it's almost a very exciting time for Cyan. Um, Laura joining us from Mexico City, Kanoi, greeting all of you all the way from Massachusetts. Zilka in Panama, Inger in um on in Wailai area right here on the island of Oahu. David in Ann Arbor, Sandy in Pennsylvania, Fern in Texas. I can't get to them all. I'm so sorry. I promise I'll write back to you in the comments. But if you're watching this replay, know that the love for Hula is alive and well around the world. And we're so glad that you're joining us today. So without any further delay, for the month of May, we have been celebrating Brada Is. And part of that is because... His birthday is coming up. I don't I, I actually didn't know this um, until I was planning for this class, but it just worked out perfectly because May 20th would have been Brother Is's birthday. And so in honor of him and his beautiful music that has taken the world by storm, even after his untimely passing, um, we've been celebrating all of his music on Saturdays. We've been learning um, some mele pupuo ni'iho and he hawaii'o, which he sang. Um, and then last Tuesday, we finished up Wind Beneath My Wings. And today, we're starting a brand new song, White Sandy Beach. Now, you're probably wondering, why didn't you do Wind Beneath My Wings and he hawaii'o together? Because that's the medley that Brother Is sang. Um, and I have an ulterior motive, that is, that when I graduated from high school 20 years ago next month, um, we did a medley of White Sandy Beach and Wind Beneath My Wings. Those two songs are the medley that's burned into my memory and my heart. So we're going to be doing um, the White Sandy Beach today. I tried to, you know, fix it so that you can either dance it with Brother Is or you can dance it my way. My way or the Is way. Okay, so... Anyways, um, before we jump into the choreography of White Sandy Beach, I wanted to be sure to go over some basic steps 
because I think that was very helpful for many of you last week. If you're an advanced dancer, it doesn't hurt to practice your basics. Remember that whatever line you come from, you probably do your basic steps a certain way. And I'm not here to try to tell you to change it because your style that you learn from your kumu is your style. Um, but if you're looking to learn our style, it's basically flat-footed um, with a slight bend, not, not too low. So let's start today with one of the most basic steps, which is the ka'o. The ka'o is a swaying motion just from side to side. And for most of our basic steps, we'll just put our hands on our waist, fingers to the front, thumbs to the back, and we're going to um, plant our feet just mm, about one foot's distance away from each other. So you could fit a third foot if you had one right in between the two. You're going to be flat footed for our style, bend knees, just slightly bent. And then you're just going to push the hips right and left, shifting the weight through the hips, through the knees, back and forth. Try to keep the upper body still, okay? Not moving too, too much. All right, okay, so that's the first one. So the ka'o is gonna be one of the most basic steps that we do. Let me put my little notes up here. Okay, the next one that we're gonna do is actually called the ka'holo. And you might have learned this as the most basic step because it's what we call the vamp um, or you know, just, just a really core of most hula choreography. It's gonna be four counts to the right, which is this way, I'm mirroring you, and then four counts to the left. Once again, hands on your waist, bend your knees slightly. That's it. I hope you're dancing with me, not just sitting on the couch. Stand up. Okay, let's take four steps to the right. Ready, go. Step, together, step, change directions. Step, together, step, and tap. Step, together, step, tap. Step, together, step, tap. Now, I'm going to ask um, my loving hubby behind the camera if we can go to the Vavai cam, which is our foot camera, so that I can show you what I mean by um, flat footed. If we were doing a style that had heels lifted, you might see more rolling on the toes like this. I'm turning to the side so you can really see the exaggerated lifting of the hips and lifting of the heel. That is not the style that my kumu, um, Le Momi e Maldonado, suggested. Not that that's wrong, but the style that she taught was very flat footed, heel and toe making contact nearly at the same time and the whole foot this way. And I'm only dancing at an angle so that you can see that my heel, yeah, maybe it comes a little bit before the toe um, sometimes or the toe before the heel, but I'm not doing really the, the pedaling move. Not that that's wrong, just a different style. Okay, so I wanted to point that out to you. Let's go ka holo to the right and left. Bend your knees, flat foot if you're trying our style. Ready, set, holo to the right, holo right, two, three, and holo left, even steps, make sure one is not larger than the other, to the right, and then to the left. Very good. Okay, back to the, the um, first view. Hello there, we're back again. Now, uh, the next step is related to this. It's called the holo holo, or sometimes called ka holo holo, but that's a lot of syllables if you ask me. Holo holo is gonna be double of the ka holo. So instead of just four, now we have eight. So we're gonna go eight counts to the right, Eight counts to the left, flat footed, bend your knees, ready, set, here we go, holo, holo, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, to the left, two, three, four, five, six, once again, to the right, right, two, three, four, five, six, to the left, and left, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, okay, so that's our Holo holo or ka holo holo, as it is sometimes called. Some people also call it an eight count holo. Some people call it a glide holo. Whatever you call it, that's that's what I'm talking about. Okay. Next, we're gonna do some movement forward and back. So the easiest way to move forward and back is to take almost that ka o sway and take it moving forward. But we call it a lele. So here's lele, a walking step. Again. Fairly flat-footed, not too much rolling on the balls of your feet. Bend the knees. And we're going to step first with the right. And then without bringing the feet together, the left foot is going to cross right in front just like that. Let's go backwards. Right and left. Okay, so if I move back a little bit further over here so you can see my feet. I'm going to take four steps forward 
and then four steps back. So right, left, right, left, and then right, left, right, left. Don't reverse that. Okay, ready? Set, stepping forward, right, le, le, left, le, le, right, le, le, left. Step back, all right, and left. And the word for moving forward is emu, going forward, right, and left, right. E hope means to the back step, right and left. Always alternate right and left. Very good. I hope you could see that. I was kind of stepping out of the screen. Okay, so that's one way to move forward and back. The next one is called the kavelu. The kavelu is going to keep your home base in the center, and you're going to take one foot forward, then come back to home base, and then one foot back. And then back to home base. Before you run, can I ask for the Vavai cam? Um, I, I just need, there you go. I could push the button myself, I suppose. Okay, so the right foot is going to go forward. And then you're going to shift that weight into the right hip. You see that? Then back to home base and bring the right foot in. Shift the weight again. So now my hip is thrust out to the right side. The left foot now is going to go to the back. Back, shift. Shift, right foot forward, Kavalu forward on the right, back left, back on the left. Who this dress, shiny, right? And forward, back on the left. And together, right foot goes forward and together and back and together. Now, this same step can be done only forward. So let's try that. Two um, forward. So right foot forward and then left foot forward. Ready? Set Kavelu with the right, going forward and together. Left foot to the forward and together. One more time. Right and together. Left foot forward and together. I guess technically you could also go back. Let's try that. Right back and then left back. Ready? Set. Here we go. Velu back and together. And then back and together. I can't say that I've ever choreographed something, but now I feel the challenge to do it. All right, let's come on back to here. The next step is going to be very similar to what we did, the Kavelu, but it's going to be turning to the sides. This one is called the O. So we're going to turn towards this side first. We're going to turn that left foot to kind of guide ourselves to turn this way towards the wall on your left. Hands on your waist again. Right foot now is going to go forward and then turn back to home base. Now the left foot is going to cross over. Forward and back to home base. Right foot again. Right and forward and left and forward. Now, all of these steps that we're doing so far are in our choreography today. So I know already Wendy's going to say, I got plenty steps. I'm sorry. I don't know what happened with this choreography. It just got kind of complicated. So, okay. That is the old step turning to the side. What else am I missing? I believe the last one. It's actually related to the lele that we did earlier, and it's called lele uwehe or uvehe. <laughs> so lele uwehe is kind of a complicated step. If you don't get it today, there's always the replay, okay? You can come back and watch the replay 10,000 times. Please do, in fact. It will be great for our analytics. So hands on your waist, slight bend. Let's take this very slowly. The first thing is the right foot is going to step out towards the right, Okay. Now, the left foot doesn't come together. It's actually going to extend forward or at that slight side, not all the way to the 45, yeah? Then bring it together. And then you're going to, I'm going to lift my skirt. I'm so sorry. Just a little bit. I'm going to lift my heels in an uwehe, okay? We haven't really talked about what is an uwehe, but trust me, you lift your heels, okay? So then we're going to go to the left step, out to the left. Point the right foot together and Uwehe. You want to see the foot cam? Bavai cam? Okay, here we go. Ready? We're going to step to the right first. That's this way. Ready? Set. Here we go. Step right. Point together. Uwehe. Left. Point together. Uwehe. Right. Point together. Uwehe. Left. Point together. Uwehe. Now, if you were keeping score last week, you noticed that we actually did something real funky that I love is we're going to do two lele uwehe in a row to the right. So it's kind of like as if we were doing a lele uwehe holo holo or something. Lele uwehe, lele uwehe. Go well, two times to the right anyways. So instead of, you're going to go step point together, step point together, but not changing direction. So start with the right foot. Ready, set. Here we go. Step right, point. 
together again to the right point now left two times go left point together way and left try again two times to the right going right point together way right point together and left going left point together way left point that's the last one okay so back to the main camera now we're gonna play a little game i'm gonna put on some music and actually i took out the voice part of the music so it's just gonna be instrumental so there's two parts of this game first part of the game is i'm gonna call out the steps all of the ones that we've practiced so far today and you just try them do your best okay i might do four of each i might do two of each i probably won't do one of each usually even numbers unless i'm feeling really nasty okay second part of it is guess the song <laughs> there's no melody playing uh, or being sung just the chords so at the end you can guess oh that that was this and this or whatever song it's like name that tune but hula style okay so here we go this is basic steps we're gonna go through everything that we learned so far no slides you gotta just remember how to do them okay does that mean can right okay can just follow me no big deal okay hands on your waist Okay, ready? Hands on your waist, bend your knees. Ka o sway. Ka holo. That's it. Right, two, three, and left, two, three. Basic. Okay, let's do holo, holo, eight counts. One, two, three, four, five, six to the left. One, two, three, four, five, six. Regular holo. That's four counts. Lele imua, walking forward. Lele hope, back. Ka holo. Always come back to that basic step, yeah? Now, kabelu, forward and back. Forward and together. Back and together. Forward. Together, back, holo, holo, eight counts. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Very good. Ka o sway. Back to ka holo. Okay, let's get ready to turn the o side turn. Right and turn. Left and turn. Right and turn. Ka holo, basic. Okay, let's lele uwehe, two times to the right. Right, point together, uwehe, right, point. Now go to the left, left, point together. Ka holo, very good, back to basic. Lele imua, walking forward. Lele hope, back. Lele uwehe, right and left. Right, point together and left. Ay, 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 you went two to the right. No, go right and then go left. Ka holo. Very good. Oh, turn to the side. Other side. Ka o. Ka velu back only. Who does that? Not me. Ka holo. That feels weird. I'm never doing that. Holo, holo, eight counts. One, two, three, four, five, six to the left. One, two, three, four. Regular ka holo. Ka velu, forward and back. Forward and back. And forward. And lele imua, walking forward. Lele hope back. Lele uehe, two times right. And two times left. I'll be okay. Nice, okay. Left, two times. Kaholo. Very good, okay. Listen carefully after this. Ka velu forward and back. All right and left. Oh, just kidding that was the end of the song and dum 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 
make my own song. Okay. Good job. Okay, did you work up a sweat? Because I did. Talking and thinking and dancing. <sighs> Might have blown a fuse up here. But anyways. Okay, did you guess the song? We got one. And were they correct? <gasps> That's right. We danced that in our May Day. So you probably heard that one billion times since you're practicing. So thank you. All right. We're moving on to the choreography now for White Sandy Beach. If I can find it. Recent White Sandy Beach. Here we are. Okay. So. White Sandy Beach was actually not written by Brother Is. It was written by a gentleman named Willie Dan. And Willie Dan is from Vietnam. Vietnam, sorry. Vietnam. And nobody really knows too much about him, but he wrote a beautiful song. So thanks, Willie. <laughs> Did you folks watch the, um, the Rep Replinger special? No, be silly. Vote Willie. <laughs> Okay, anyways, you got to go Google it, YouTube, check them out. Okay, okay. <laughs> so White Sandy Beach of Hawaii is written not by Brother Is, by this other gentleman, Mr. Dan. Um, and it has a verse, a chorus, a second verse. We do the chorus two times. So um, this choreography I cannot take credit for. Actually, this was choreographed by my kumu, Le Momi I Maldonado, and we danced it, I believe, at the Kamehameha Day um, competition at the Blaisdell, the round, what is that, arena, um, and we danced it there. I think that's where, Kanoi, you have to correct me if I'm wrong, but I think that's where we danced it. Um, and so this is my Kumu's choreography that she allowed me to use as a senior in high school and that I pass on to you now. So anyhow, um, let's start with the hands. I saw you in my dreams. Your left hand is going to be right here by the corner of your eye. So eyebrow, eye, right kind of in that area, and your palm is facing out. Yeah. Your right hand is going to be overhead at the 45 degree angle, and it's, it's up there. So you're going to tilt all the chins, get all those chins up so that they kind of meld into one chin. Yeah. And you're going to look up at that hand, and then it's going to drop down to about eye level, and you're going to drop your gaze. Keep all the chins together, though, if you can. Okay, so let's try once more. Left hand by the eye, right hand up. I saw you in my dreams. Simple, right? We were walking hand in hand. You're going to bring your hands to the side of your body at about waist level, not too low. Yep. And you're going you're gonna to bring them together in front of you. Now, when you bring them together, you're making a clasp with your hands. Your right hand is going to be on the top, and the left hand is going to be holding underneath it, just like this. So this is the clasp that you're forming. And it's not off to the side. I just wanted you to see a side angle. It's actually right here in front of your chest. Yeah. So I guess when you do this, it can be a little bit higher than waist level. Maybe it's more like chest level. We were walking hand in hand. Bring the hands together. OK, let's go from the beginning. I saw you in my dreams. Left hand by your eye, right hand up. I saw you in my dreams. We were walking hand in hand. On a white sandy beach, this one, you're going to push your hands right in the center of your body, um, parallel to the ground, not too low. On a white, on that sandy beach, I love this motion that my kumu would do. You're going to pull these hands right alongside your hips. So it goes center, open, and pull back. Some of my ladies that have been dancing with me for a long time know this is a signature move of my kumu. And the feet work that go with it really make this motion. So center, open, and pull back. And there's this attitude, right? You're looking here and oh, sandy beach. That's it. OK? So let's go from I saw you in my dreams. Left hand at your eye, right hand up. I saw you in my dreams. We were walking hand in hand on a white sandy beach. Okay, let's put that together with some feet. I saw you in my dreams when you have this motion. You're going to kaholo toward the right and left. So here we go. Ready, go. 
I saw you in my dreams. Now we were walking hand in hand, hands right about chest level, straight out to the side though. We're gonna lele imua, walk forward four times. We were walking hand in hand. That's it, okay? I wanna try with this overhead cam if we can, just so that they can see the angles a little bit better. Hello there, okay, I saw you. Ready, holo. I saw you in my dreams walking forward. We were walking hand in hand right there. Okay, on a white sandy beach, this one, when you push forward, you're actually going to do a cavelu with your right foot and then forward and then back on the left. Remember that step goes like this. On a white, together, sandy beach. Okay, try it with me. Ready? Just a feet. Ready? Go. On a white, together first, sandy beach, back on the left, and then together. Okay, now put the hands together. This is going to be the forward part, and then this is your attitude pulling back. Ready, step forward, right. On a white, pulling back, sandy beach. Yeah, that's it. Okay, let's go all the way from I saw you. Ready, holo, right. I saw you in my dreams, stepping forward four times. We were walking hand in hand forward on a white back, sandy beach. Yeah, how was that? Good? Okay, try it with the regular view now. No overhead bird's eye view now. Okay, so here we go. I saw you in my dreams. Ready, go. I saw you in my dreams forward. We were walking hand in hand, forward right, on a white, back left, sandy beach. Okay, of Hawaii is the next part. Right hand is across your chest, left hand is out. We're going to do a little bit wax on, wax off action. Remember that movie? What movie was that, Karate Kid? Wax on, wax off. You remember that? That's not how it looked in the movie, yeah? It should have been like that. It was prettier. Okay? So the left hand is going to make a big circle in and then opposition. You know what? We got to go back to that other camera so you can see the circles, right? Okay, so here we go. Here's what this looks like. One hand is going to come into the chest and the other hand back out again. Okay, so it should be your left hand coming in first and then the right hand after that. You got that? Okay, and we're going to stay here because uh, the feet for this is a little wonky. And I think I'm going to call it the wax on, wax off holo. Because here's what it looks like. If we were just doing a straight kaholo, kaholo to the right and kaholo to the left. But this kaholo is going to turn us to the back. I know we didn't practice this in basics because it doesn't make sense until you put it into a song. So we're going to turn to the back. Kaholo to the back, that's wax on. And then we're not gonna turn back this way. We're gonna hook around. We're gonna go one, two, three, tap. I promise it's still a kaholo. I know it looks real fancy, but it's just a kaholo right and left. So watch again. Are you watching or are you trying it? Because if you turn to the back and you don't see me, then you're not gonna know what I'm doing. So just watch. Ready? Turning to the back first. Kaholo to the back, tap. Uh-huh, I know, you're cheating. And then you're going to go around. One, two, three, tap. Still just a kaholo. Do it with me. Put your weight on the left foot. We're going to go around to the right. Don't forget to tap. Ready, set. Here we go. Kaholo to the back and tap. Hook it around and then you're back. Are you back? Am I back? I don't know. Okay, now we're going to wax on and wax off with the kaholo. Good luck. Put your weight on the left foot. Left hand is coming in as we move to the right. Ready, set. Here we go. Wax onto the back. Don't forget the tap and hook around to the front. Here we are. Okay, practice the replay maybe. I don't know how that one was. Give me a, get, let me know how it's going for you. Good, bad, ugly. Okay, try one more time. I saw heart. Good job, good job. Okay, one more time. Put your weight on the left foot. Let's wax onto the right. Ready, set. Here we go, of Hawaii, tap, bum, bum. 
Okay, we're going to put it all together in this angle, and then we'll come back to the regular one. I know this one makes you dizzy a little bit. So, Ready? I saw you. Here we go. I saw you in my dreams. Forward four steps. We were walking hand in hand. Forward on the right. On a white. Back left. Sandy beach. Wax on, wax off of Hawaii and wax off around. Yeah? Bad? Yeah. Okay, let's come back to the regular camera. Try it one time with this angle without the music and then we'll try it with the music. Okay, you tell me which angle you like better. Okay. All right. I'm going to move back so you can see my feet. I saw you. Ready and go. I saw you in my dreams. Forward four steps. We were walking hand in hand. Keep going forward. On a white, pulling back. Sandy beach of Hawaii. And hook around to the side. Okay, we're going to try it with the thing. What did they say? Eek. Michelle, that's okay. Just watch the replay for 10,000 times. I know the turns are really hard for me to teach on Facebook. So hopefully one day I can come and teach you how to do it in person because it is not fun to teach turns on Facebook. I try to say so many words, and I don't think it's helping. I'm sorry. I admit <laughs> defeat. Okay, here we go. From the beginning with the music. If you are the wind beneath my song. Not quite yet. This is our intro. I saw you hold low to the right. I saw you in my dreams. Stepping forward. We were walking hand in hand. Continue forward on the right. Call on that. A Back left. Follow around. Right, left, right, tap, left, right, left. We were playing in the sun. It's making me nervous. You gotta tell me how it's going. Like the camera in front. Okay, thanks, Wendy. Thank you. Okay. Uh, oh no, no. Wendy said I like your explanation. It's good. So, thank you. Okay. Um, <laughs> we made it through four lines. Okay. Let's see if we can make it through a verse and the chorus. We'll see. We'll see about that. We'll see. Okay. So that was the first part. Shall we try one more time with music now that you kind of get that? Okay, we're going to try and pick it up right at the little intro. <laughs> okay, here we go. I saw you in my dreams. I saw you in my dreams. We were walking hand in hand on a wall. I noticed that I did something bad, bad kumu. I put my hands like this instead of like this. If you're watching that closely, um, I have practiced this song one million times for competition and for graduation. So I have a bad habit of dancing it right way. Um, but when I dance it for you, I have to flip it. So if I accidentally go like this, I'm wrong. I definitely want your right hand on the top and the left hand on the bottom. I just caught myself doing it. I wanted to make sure, because I know some of you folks are very detail-oriented. When you're stepping forward, make sure it's the right fingers on the top and the left hand that wraps around the bottom, okay? Sorry about that. Okay, let's move on. We were playing in the sun. We were having so much fun on a white sandy beach of Hawaii. You would think every time you get on a white sandy beach of Hawaii that you'll get the same thing, but it's not. Oh, you got to go back. We're still at verse 1. There we are. Okay. So we, uh, after here, so sorry. Okay. We were playing in the sun. This right hand that's outstretched is going to come across so that you have sort of almost a love motion. Yeah. Kind of close to your body, but not totally collapsed. We were playing in the sun. Your hands are going to open here and then it's going to draw a sun motion. Now, the sun is two places. It's sort of right here, 
but we're not going to drop the thumbs. I think of this more as like a moon motion, but you're going to bring your hands here and it's this whole circle here. Okay, so try and keep it round like this. So from here, cross out your chest. We were playing open in the sun. Okay, got that? Yeah, a little bit of separation between the thumbs and the, the fingers is okay, but not big platter round. Yeah, just like this is good. Try again. We were playing. We were playing in the sun. Okay, we were having so much fun. You're going to bring your hands into your cheeks, palms facing toward you, and then you're going to flip over. Chizu, having so much fun. Okay, no, hands like this. Yeah, very good. Okay, um, on a white sandy beach. On this one, we don't get to do wax on, wax off. We're actually going to put our hands right down at sand level on a white sandy beach of Hawaii. Okay, so you're going to keep your hands here. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. Guess what step goes with that? Okay. Of Hawaii, gonna do a place motion. My right hand is facing towards that um, left wall, and my left hand is up, palms up at the 45 degree angle. Okay, so let's go from we're playing in the sun, just the hands. You finished here at the end of the first half. Okay, ready, cross first. We were playing in the sun, smiling. We were having so much fun. On a white, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, Hawaii. Okay. And then I think we actually split the palms down after that. So hold up for four, two, three, four, and then flip out. Okay. That's it. So now let's add the feet for that end of the first verse. I promise you the course is short and verse two is short. So if we can make it through verse one today, we'll be halfway through the song. Maybe. Okay. So we were playing in the sun. Kaholo. Regular. How's that? Yeah, after all that spinning. We were playing in the sun. Kaholo, right? We were having so much fun. And you have to show the fun on your face. This part on a white sandy beach. I don't know if anybody guessed it, but it's an eight count hold here and we're going to do a holo holo ka -a puni in the feet so instead of just taking your holo holo to the right two three four five six seven eight we're going to take it around the island so let's take a look at the vavai cam and we're going to go around the island to the right so it's turn one two three four five six seven eight and then we're going to get a kaholo to the left and kao right, kao left. I didn't tell you that was happening, but holo, holo first, kaholo, and then two kaos. Okay, let's try that. Ready, just that sequence. Go around two, three, four, five, six, seven of Hawaii, kao right, and left. Okay, come back to regular camera. We were playing in the sun, having so much fun, all kaholo. Just do up to there. Ready, go. Cross at your chest and open to the sun and cheeks in. We were having, smiling, so much fun. Okay, then on a white sandy beach, your hands literally stay right here while your body turns. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, and place motion and then flip the ka'o and ka'o that's the whole thing yeah we just put it all together okay so let's try now we were playing in the sun and i'm gonna ask luke to switch to the overhead cam when we get to the holo holo because that's when it starts to get like oh where is she going okay so ready we were playing get ready hands here holo to the right ready and cross we were playing in the sun, smiling cheeks. We were having so much fun. Here we go, change camera. On a white, two, three, four, five, six, seven. And we're back to the front and ka'o, ka'o. How was that? Good? Okay. So 
that is the whole first verse. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight lines when I make it like this. We're going to try this with the music. Now, if you have questions about placement of hands or feet, um, angles, any of that, try your best to type it into the chat. Let us know which part of the verse you're asking about and you know how to ask for a clarification on a specific foot motion or hand motion. Otherwise, just say, what is having so much fun? And then I'll do my best. Okay, here we go. Oh, I'm glad you like it, Fern. Okay, here we go from the intro. I saw you holo right. I saw you in my dreams. We were walking hand in Continue hand. Continue forward on the right. On a oh, there, I did it again. Wrong hand. Of a light. Turn. Playing. We were playing in the sun. We were having so much fun. On a white sandy beach of a lake. Ka'o, ka'o. Sounds of the ocean. How was it? Good? Yeah? Yeah? I don't see any questions, so you're probably going to kill me, but I'm going to do the chorus now. Okay? All right. Let's do it. <laughs> okay. Here comes the chorus, um, and then we'll have just a little tiny, tiny piece to finish next week. The sound of the ocean soothes my restless soul. Sound of the ocean rocks me all night long. Okay. This is where our lele uehe comes back into play. So my kumu was the first one to do this lele uehe two times to the right, at least that I learned. And then we borrowed that when we did Wind Beneath My Wings, that little piece, and we put it into our choreography. So this is actually where it came from, the first time that I ever saw the double lele uehe from my kumu hula. So in case you care of the origin story of my entire choreography. Right hand is by your ear, left hand is going to be out toward the um, 45 degree angle. Sound of, on the ocean, left hand is gonna pull into your body, the right hand is going to go around, okay? So it's not both hands making la 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 bamba, okay, no, not that, okay? You're gonna bring your hand in, left hand pulls in, and the right hand goes around. My kumu was very specific. It wasn't both hands going, one hand is going around. It's just that this hand happens to be pulling into your body at the same time. So, sound of the ocean, okay? Soothes my restless soul. Okay, did you see how that went? Sounds, pull in the left hand, of the ocean. Now, both hands go out. Soothes my, this is towards a 45 degree angle, and I'm using kind of my wrist as a guide for where to put that other hand. Soothes my restless, and then bring it into your chest, two hands facing in. Soul, and then next sound of the ocean, other side. Sounds, now the right hand pulls in, left hand goes around, of the ocean. Now, this one is gonna come from your pico. That's your belly button, by the way. Rocks me all night long. And then you're gonna do, Long right hand and left hand. Nope, I lied. It's here across your chest. This way and this way. I just felt wrong. Okay, so let me slow that down a little bit. Let's go from sound of the ocean. Right hand at your ear, left hand is out. Ready? Hold here. Sound of the ocean. Then out. Soothes my restless soul. Opposition now. Sound of the ocean rocks me all night long. That's the chorus. Okay. So pretty. I just love this song. Willie. Willie. Know how to hit me with the hits. I don't think he wrote any other songs, though. One hit, Willie. Okay, sound of the ocean is that lele uehe two times to the right. Let's practice the feet one more time. 
Can we get Vava Cam? Okay, so we're gonna do two lale uhe to the right first. Ready, set, here we go. Step, point, together, uwehe, step, point, together, now left. Actually, just kidding, just do right, just do right. Okay, so here's what we're gonna do. Face your body towards the 45 degree angle. See how my toes are pointing? At this point, I actually want you to face that way. Turn towards the corner that's on your right. Yeah, the 45 degree angle at your right. Now, instead of going straight to the side, we're gonna let it way toward the back corner, your back right corner. So it's gonna go step, point, together, uwehe, step, point, together, uwehe. Now, a funky thing is you're wanting to go left probably after this, because we just went right, right. But my kumo, my kumo is a genius. So she went right, right, and then she went right again. You're gonna kaholo to the right. A holo to the right, and then you're gonna lele left, lele right, then go to the left, lele uehe to the left, and lele uehe to the left. Okay, so that sequence is a little wonky, but let's go over it one more time. Face towards the corner. Okay, give yourself a little space. Hopefully, your couch is not right next to you, and we're gonna do. Two lale way to the right and then continue to the right. Ready, set, here we go. Step, right point, left together. Uwehe, step, right point, left together. Kaholo to the right and then step left and right. Step back, left point, right together. Uwehe, left point, right together. And kaholo to the right. And kaholo to the left and ka o right and left and getting ahead of myself. Okay, come back, come back, come back. Let's come back to the real, the real camera now. Okay. Uh, <laughs> sound of the ocean. The hand that is by your ear is the direction that you're going, and you're trailing with the hand that is outstretched. Okay, so I have my weight on my left foot. My left hand is outstretched. I'm going to step back towards the right goes like this sound of the ocean then hands go away from you soothes my restless now you're gonna step soul step into the hands bum bum now we'll go to the left sound of the ocean now go right rocks me all night long sway two times Okay, don't quit your day job. I know it's a lot. I know it's a lot to take in, but I thought if you could at least be introduced to it this week, practice, 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 and then next week I'll teach it again. Okay, I'll teach that whole chorus slowly if I can um, to really, really get it. But I want to introduce it to you, and you can watch the replay, and then next week it will be easy peasy. These are not easy combinations. I should have said that in the description. Not for beginners, but um, if you keep practicing, I know you can do it. So let's try it with the music. Don't get frustrated if you end up on the wrong foot. Just keep practicing. And the more you get familiar with the words and, and the combinations, it will be easy. Maybe later. Not right now, but later. Yeah, it is a fun combo, right? I'm glad you like it, Ziola. Is it Ziola or Ziola? I'm going to try to catch the chorus. Having so much fun on a wide Surround. sandy beach of Hawaii. La la ue, hey, here we go. Sounds of the ocean. Step two times. And the sound of the ocean rocks me all night long. Those hot, long summer days. Okay, I even didn't get it perfect. So don't beat yourself up. Let's try it all from the beginning. Verse, verse, and chorus. Maybe we'll try and do it about three times before we go today. And if you have questions, be sure to drop it into the comments. If I don't get to it, 
during class, I'll be sure to reach out to you and try and answer them. I know there's tricky parts, but here we go. Not, not fair. Here we go. Let's do a two-hand kaholo to the right and left. Go. I saw you. I saw you in my dreams. Lele, you were walking forward. You were walking hand in right hand. Right hand on top. On a white Back. sandy beach. Wax off. Of a Wax off. We were playing. We were playing in the sun. We were having so much fun. On a white sandy beach of Hawaii. Sound of the ocean. Lele, we hit two times. Sounds of the ocean. Let it wehe left two times. Sound of the ocean rocks me all night long. Those hot long summer days. Okay, that was number one. Now, if you've ever learned this choreography from me before, you know there's one part where you're facing to an angle instead of straight. I'm not going to fix that right now. Um, just do it exactly how we have. Don't worry, we'll get to those fine details a little bit later. Here comes number two. Practice time number two. Two hand hollow to the right and left. I saw you follow your hands, tilt the chins I up. I saw you in my dream. Hands at chest level, follow the right we hand. Were walking hand in hand. Right hand on top, look on down, look to the left, follow the left hand in, Hawaii. and right hand out. We were playing this is the part where we're going to angle sun. later. And then front. We were having so much fun. On a white, first look on at the hands, and then look away. Sandy beach of Hawaii. Ka'o, look beyond the left hand. Soothes my Look down. restless soul. Look beyond the right hand. Sound of the ocean. Look down. Rocks me all night. Tilt up. Long. Follow the right hand. Those hot Very long good. summer days. Okay, last time through, I'm going to try to zip it. And let's just enjoy dancing it. If you make a mistake, no worries. The replay will be up shortly. You can always ask questions. Here we go. Last practice for today of first verse and chorus of Willie Dan's rager hit, White Sandy Beach. job you worked very hard today that was a lot of basics at the beginning and uh, got your sweat on we made it through quite a lot of white sandy beach i want you to remember to go back and practice wind beneath my wings and of course come on saturdays to learn hey hawaii because next week not only will we finish white sandy beach but we'll put all of the medleys together so we'll do 
White Sands E Beach and no, sorry, Wind Beneath My Wings and Hey Hova El. And then we'll do Wind Beneath My Wings and White Sandy Beach. And hopefully I won't throw any other craziness at you. Um, I did want to let you know that we have an exciting opportunity. Our halal, which you're part of our global hula ohana, but we've been invited to put together a little performance for the city and county of Honolulu's Na Hula Festival, um, which is going to be going live at the beginning of August. So stay tuned. Because in early July, I'm going to be asking if you folks would like to submit videos and be a part of our segment for the Nahula Festival, which will be um, brought, put out by the City and County of Honolulu's um, Parks and Recreation Division. So keep your eye out for that. It's going to be a fun opportunity for you to show what you've learned. And um, I think we're going to do White Sandy Beach for that one. So just know that's coming. Um, anyways, I hope you had a fabulous day with us today at Hula. Thank you for being here. So appreciate you. Luke behind the camera appreciates you too. Um, on behalf of our Ohana, which you are a part of, keep practicing and off we go.